Hey there, Tracy Noriega paying it forward to you on this Mindful Monday. How you doing? Hope all is well with you. And today's Mindful Monday um, kind of spills over from last week. I had that great, uh, you know, little adventure finding a nice spot on the beach uh, where there were less people. I also got myself a bit of poison oak. So uh, once again, <laughs> even with that whole thing that I did about you're always on your path, well, I guess sometimes your path might have some poison oak, so please beware and mindful of that as well. But that's not what I'm here to talk about. When I was on the beautiful beach, I was noticing as I was walking along it, tons of trash, and it's not the first time this has happened, whether at the beach or at a park or even like last weekend, um, I was in San Diego and along the harbor and just all of the trash left at the park and there is a garbage. So yeah, I'm calling out you litter bugs and maybe you're not even mindful that you're being a litter bug. <laughs> maybe you're not even thinking about the fact of what you're doing is littering. But if you open up a wrapper and take off even just a bottle cap or something and just discard it on the ground, um, open up a, a bag of anything, rip it open and take that and just dump it and don't put it in a receptacle, that's littering, my friends. That is littering. I'm calling you out on it. You're not putting it where it belongs, okay? And yes, not every place has garbage cans which is a whole nother you know point of contention as well because they have these public places and parks and then don't put receptacles out for people um, this is even in on on walking paths and stuff you know again you have a dog and you are pick, you know pick up the 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 feces you know the dog poop thank you for putting it in a plastic bag or a paper bag or whatever it is but you're gonna leave it there now? Like somebody's supposed to pick up your dog's poop? I mean, that's, again, you, it's your dog, your responsibility. Find a trash can on the way and and do it. Or you know what, tie it to your dog. <laughs> have have your dog uh, pack it in, pack it out, right? But I'm just, it's, it's just so, I do, I get infuriated watching people eating something, finishing something and just tossing it and sometimes even out their window of their car. And I've, I've had a moment where in a motorcycle just driving up to somebody and saying, I'm sorry, really? You didn't think you could just put it in your car or on the, on the seats or something? Yeah. So anyway, I'm going to just call that out and be mindful of what you're doing. I don't think people are always thinking about it. I've been on cleanups before and, uh, last summer actually on the lake in Arizona and it dries up because it's also a reservoir and it was really interesting to see like you know exactly what they were doing because it's just a whole area on the ground just of cigarette butts and beer caps so you know you know they parked parked they dropped their anchor and they're partying on the boat i i've been there i've done that but really you have to flick all of your cigarette butts out into the water it's not like they dissolve you know and i don't think that people are thinking about that they don't dissolve they uh they stay there and they're exactly the way they look when they after they've been in the water and they dry up at the bottom of the lake they're they're all intact it's right there same with your bottle caps they're all right there so you can see how long you know a party was there it's just all under the water and it it doesn't go away and same thing with plastic bags and you know your plastic containers for your drinks your water etc um i understand you know you have a little bonfire or something but hey bring a bag and you bought a bag to bring everything in it put it all back in and take it out you know how would you like somebody coming over to your house and just you know eating whatever and just throwing it on the floor or just leaving it there it, there's absolutely really no difference than that and this is you know our earth our mother earth and um, we've only got one and you know you've really got to think about the things we're doing to her because they do have consequences and we're also the ones to pay for it 
And I'm not even talking, I'm just here talking about littering. I'm not even talking about, you know, uh, a gentleman I saw the other day changing his oil and then just dumping the oil in into the street, into the, you know, into the side of the road. Like it's just gonna, it goes right back into our drinking water, you guys. It goes out into our waterways. It goes in where our birds are and everything. And, you know, <clears throat> you know people wonder about all the cancers that are coming out and the things that we do but you've got to think about our pesticides and the stuff you use to clean your house um, just really being mindful of what it is we're doing and um, I'm just gonna stay on the litter don't be a litter bug okay there's really no excuse for it um, you brought it in if you have a backpack or a purse or a man bag or whatever you you know bring it back out use that same bag to put everything back in and look for a trash can and put it away and if you don't have one you know carry it until you find one and if you have to take it back home take it back home okay just stop littering stop littering all right all right that's it for now i'm gonna get off my little soapbox um and i'm hoping you have a great day and be mindful. Be mindful of your environment and what you're doing and be mindful of Mother Earth, okay? We're all here and we're all living here together. So let's keep her clean and enjoy you guys. Take care, like, subscribe, share, comment, and have a great day. Wishing you lots of love, joy, happiness, peace, grace, and ease. Cheers.